Scalpel UAV. Russia unleashes new kamikaze drone on Ukraine that is significantly cheaper than Lancet. Welcome to my YouTube channel and I am iBoot if you want more videos subscribe my YouTube channel. Russian state news agency TASS reported on November 18 that Russian units began to use the new scalpel munition in the so-called Special Operation Zone. We have started small-scale production of the scalpel platform currently 20 are produced monthly. If necessary, production can be significantly expanded. At the moment one batch of scalpels in the amount of 15 products has been delivered to the SVO zone the manufacturer of the scalpel drone Vostok Design Bureau was quoted as saying. Russian servicemen have reportedly highlighted the expendable drone's excellent handling and ease of operation. Reviews from pilots are mostly positive the device is well controlled accurate stable when diving and easy to aim. The fighters also note the product's simplicity in preparation for the flight, the Vostok Design Bureau said. The platform has been projected as a less expensive version of the well-known Russian kamikaze drone Lancet manufactured by the Kalashnikov Concerns Zala subsidiary. The manufacturer noted that there were several areas where the scalpel fell short as compared to the Lancet. Still those shortfalls were understandable given the significantly lower cost of the scalpel drone. A single scalpel drone costs 300,000 rubles, not including the payload price. Vostok further emphasized that the scalpel differs significantly from Lancet because it has a target capturing mechanism and a camera. The drone deployment is two months after Vostok Design Bureau conducted the test flights of the brand new, multi-purpose, single-use platform in early September. At the time, the manufacturer revealed that the drone was meant for combat against Ukraine and would enter mass production by October 2023. The platform, meant for the Russian army, is designed to have various warheads to accomplish different tasks. He tried to make the platform as versatile as possible. The payload compartment is made with a diameter of 125 mm and a length of 650 mm with the expectation that each unit will independently decide which warhead to deploy based on its capabilities, a previous statement from the manufacturer said. Thanks for watching like this video and subscribe my YouTube channel.